Let's check out the win OTK from GBA. What? Side games. Damn, we harp gaming, eh? <laughs> Damn, dude. We actually harp gaming now. Holy. <laughs> oh, man. All because of this, huh? Gotta put her in there now. Being heart specialty allies to em bring heart specialty allies to empower Karo's lover of arts, protector of people, and guarantee he'll deal triple attacks. Then use Henriette's thing to let him do multiple times so in one turn. <laughs> Continue your symphony of skills in the order of buffs, debuffs, and finally damage, making the most of tools like illusions. Oratorio for a bonus elemental damage effect and Cantate's Capricci for another defense lowering debuff. Bring the house down on your foe. <laughs> what the hell? Damn, at least, at least now we see Opus in there though. Wow, damn, featuring all the new characters already, man. That's crazy, dude. Seriously, this is new. This is new. <laughs> this is also fairly new. Damn, man. Oh, wow. <laughs> Even asking you to farm raw now, man. Damn, son. Wrestler. Spina awakens spin and Noah's abyssal surge. Let them attack twice each turn. Make it count by supplementing normal attack damage with Spina's skill momentum up and amplifying it with Lucia's winds of valor. After inflicting debuffs upon the foes with Lucas thing, Noah's thing, tag team, and get that KO. I'm pretty sure you do not need her. <laughs> I am 100% certain you do not need her for a team like this. Why Why does it feel like this is kind of worse than this or this? Though I, though I have to say, after I, I do have to hand it to, to Sai Games for one thing. They are really trying their best to set up basically non-mirrored non uh, setup on every single Guild War. They don't want to use Relic Buster every time, even though Relic Buster is literally the best uh, candidate for that for newer players. Petra's Elemental Breath to boost attack and debuff the foe, huh? Man, this looks so cringe. <laughs> this is not even a full Magna Tree yet, man. What the hell? <laughs> Why is this not a full Magna Tree setup, man? What is there? You fucking harps and two... Oops. Two raw axes. All right, what the hell was I using the year before? Ah, yes, this is my last year, last year, last win favorite Guild War OTK. Does this still work? I don't think it does. <laughs> I, I remember this was uh, Huan Long support or something, right? Yeah, I don't think this works anymore, that's for sure. You know, now I think about it, right? Isn't Guild War on a Friday, technically? Because it says on the 7th, right? Isn't the 7th a Thursday? And the 7 is basically like the at night one, right? It starts at 7 p.m. Japan time. So then you have basically the entire day, the following day, which is the Friday, to have the entire prelims with it. So technically, we can just use uh, Ultimate Friday for that, right? Yeah, technically, we are we are sh should be able to use Ultimate Friday. If I want to do Babu, I have to use guaranteed triple characters. Huh? I don't recall who has that. All right, this guy is guaranteed triple. Alright, so for now, MC is gonna stick to Glorybringer. Because at least I can just use this. Second Tiama is probably better. There we go. Uh, this one, this one, this one's fine. This one, then... Uh, yeah, I think Bahamut should be fine. If I manage to farm Fly King, nope, I don't think I did. I put like zero effort in the race, so don't don't even think about it. One, two, okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, I think I can change this to something else. So I think I could probably use uh double strike key probably. Feels like overkill. I don't know. I'm just just uh toying around, right? No harm. Let me uh change my Ultima first. So I need auto cap, right? Auto cap and the amplifier thing. All right, so this is awakened properly. Yep. This is the only one still in Mark One, but okay. So, uh, summon. I think I should be using this, right? Is that enough? Oh, that's actually more than enough. <laughs> this 
This guy can hit one more time, isn't it? Oh, you know what? Hold on a second. Let's try this. <laughs> yeah, let's try that and see. Oh, that's still enough. Holy shit. Okay. Yeah, so Kaguya is still alright. Yeah, I think this is fine. Yeah, honestly, I think this is okay. I might just stick with this. So I just have to turn off everything and then just summon and it should be fine. The amount of hassle I need to go through with just only one extra button is just... <laughs> How fast we farm meat right now, I don't think it really matters too much, so whatever. Just press one button. I kind of did that the last time around. It, does, it didn't even feel that bad, so... I will stick with this. To make things better, I can use this one Kaguya too. Instead of needing to use two damage uh, summons. So let's try without those two at the back. See, do I have any damage? Let's... Oh, I did lose damage. Oh shit. <laughs> oh damn, I did lose damage. Freya actually lost damage there. But still seems okay though. Wow, Freya actually lost damage. <laughs> wow, that Freya, you are so shit. <laughs> but I think the damage fall off should be fine anyway, right? Because like... The, uh, what's you call it? Uh, Sleepy Tato does nuke twice. Yeah, I think the fall off should be fine. I don't think it's really that bad. Yeah, I think I'll just, I'll just remove the two guys at the back line. Yeah, because I did recall there are times where... The boss only targeted like maybe two out of four characters. It's possible. So it'll be a 99% uh, clear rate. <laughs> a 99.9 .9 clear rate. But I feel like if I have any, I just need to equip anyone with a, with a sword. I think it's more or less guaranteed already, I think. Like you. Let me try. <laughs> Let me just equip another character that is a sword. Because I think if I just equip another sword character, I think it should still be okay. I think if I want it to be better, I think I have to use like Freya key or something. Right? Most likely. Hey, stop, stop, stop! <laughs> Yeah, she's still triple there. Yeah, I mean, it's okay though, right? It, I mean, it seems okay. Her triple attack still seems okay. Because I don't... I Wait, I don't think Potato has tri guaranteed triple, is it? <laughs> oh, is it because of this? 7%. 8%. So that's extra 15% as well just by herself. Maybe the chance of her triple attack is really high because of this. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. <laughs> Interesting. She hasn't whiffed yet. What the hell? Okay, so... Uh, conclusion, this will be my setup. <laughs> so I have two guaranteed triple, so that's fine. MC is technically guaranteed triple as well with the help of that. I can just put Esther here for more treasure hunting -y. And I guess I'll just put this guy as well. Right. <laughs> And then I go journey drops. Yeah. Yeah, I think that should be fine, eh? I think just doing it like this is okay. Just Babu call and call it call it a day, man. It still seems very consistent. And it's not like I'm really losing that much time either because nowadays, uh because of the increase of HP as well, Babu call doesn't doesn't force the the overdrive, which technically burns your time too, right? So that's actually really nice. That was a very long testing for no reason. But for everyone else, just Relic Buster if you're weak. I don't think you need to do any of this. Just Relic Buster. If you have anyone with CA reactivation, have that enabled as well. Just press that button to do CA reactivation or something. And I'm fairly certain you'll be fine. If you still have problems uh, getting damage, make sure you debuff or you just call Babu as well if you have it. If not, then uh, just press extra skills on nukes and call it a day.